Now we're going to test the game mode for the Samsung QN85A. As you guys can confirm right here, game mode is on right there. And we're just going to dive right in by showing you guys the results. So as we run our test here, got the input lag tester going. You guys can see right there the input lag, 10.2 milliseconds. And I got as low as 9. It fluctuated to 9.4 and then went like almost immediately right back up to 10. So it is one of those things, but I'll just call it at 10.2 because that is the most consistent measurement there. And there you guys can see it's finally hitting 9.4. So again, it can get as low as 9.4. Now also pay attention to the amount of blooming you guys are seeing. It's pretty noticeable. And that's something that you will notice in game mode as well. It's a thousand times worse in person. So just seriously keep that in mind. I mean, seriously, just look at all of that. It's just pretty terrible. Now that we tested that, we have to test what standard looks like. So now I'm in standard. If you wanted to go outside of game mode to show you again what your input lag is going to look like. And as you guys can see, we're at 77 milliseconds. Now, again, that's outside of game mode in standard, as you can probably see right around here. We're in standard. I've got to focus the camera, try to focus it. It's not really focusing all that great, but you guys can see that it is in standard mode. And uh, it's really hard because I'm doing this one handed, but that's essentially it. It did drop down to 76. That was like the lowest that I did see it go. So 76, 77 milliseconds. Now keep in mind, this is 1080p. It is expected, obviously, that when you're upwards to 60 FPS or even when you go into um, 120 FPS, input lag will get lower. So, I mean, it can only get better from here. So, not a bad showing at all. Very responsive and great news for gamers. However, the blooming that's associated with game mode, I don't know if you can see all that, is it's pretty, pretty damn bad. Like, it's, it's pretty legendarily bad. Anybody that has this input lag tester can easily see that there's a lot of like bright spotting in the blooming. It's just, it's one of those things. So keep that in mind. The input lag is low, but the blooming is pretty terrible. So I don't know, each person is going to have to weigh up how important that is to them. But essentially outside of game mode, 76 milliseconds inside game mode, 9.4 at your lowest point, 10.2 on average. So that being said, thanks so much for watching the number one brand in honesty. And until the next video... I'll see you guys later.